3D printing is a technology with significant economic potential for European businesses, notably for small innovative enterprises, and many countries have started to adapt strategies to promote its development. The technology, however, also raises legal and ethical questions. Different studies of the Commission have shown the existence of loopholes in EU legislation regarding the use of 3D printing. Recent tragic events have raised concerns and concerned the need of action at EU level. On October 9, 2019, two people were killed and two people were injured in Halle, Germany, when an attacker tried to enter the local synagogue during Yom Kippur, uh, the Jewish holiday. The attacker used a 3D printed weapon, the blueprint of which he uploaded on Twitter. Already in its 2018 report, the Jury Committee expressed concerns regarding the manufacturing of weapons of explosive and drugs and other hazardous products in the context of 3D printing, but also regarding the problems relating to civil liability and intellectual property rights. In light of the urgency of this matter, the Jury Committee would like, the European, uh, would like to ask the European Commission the following. How do you intend to tackle this problem by the use of 3D printed illicit objects? Do you foresee any, uh, taking any legislative action based on ongoing and previous studies and evaluations? If so, which EU measures do you foresee to be impacted? And what is the timeline of the actions you plan to undertake? What will you do to ensure a timely response? And finally, what progress has been made regarding the actions the Commission has committed to undertake following the 2018 jury report? Thank you. Thank you, Chair. Thank you.